With the calendar year winding down, so too does the agricultural year, and the River Valley Cooperative held its annual Ag Outlook Conference tonight. TV6's Brianna Baylog was at that conference and joins us now with Farmer Reaction. Brianna? Yeah, hundreds of farmers gathered at Rhythm City Casino where that AG Outlook Conference was held. Experts from the agricultural industry spoke about current farming topics. Each and every year it gets bigger and better and we're just really excited to, to, to have it each year. Over 600 people were in attendance at the conference, the majority of them farmers. Overwhelming information that uh, a farmer is exposed to on a daily basis of what's impacting markets uh, here domestically is, you know, dependent on weather in South America, our geopolitical issues across uh, the world, and they're just a little overload of information. So trying to sort that out and trying to fit it into a risk management plan uh, to make farmers more profitable in their operations on a day-to-day -day basis. The drought over the summer hurt the soybean crop, but the outlook for next year's looks more productive. For corn, farmers say that wasn't affected by the drought. Corn was actually crazy. We, we saw it with the dry weather, it wasn't going to amount to a hill of beans, and the corn really surprised us. Uh, I, I had some of the best fields I've ever had in my life. The beans depend on the type of dirt, you know, if it was good soil, they were good, but if it was on poor soil, well, so the beans, they really needed rain in August. It's critical for people to comprehend what all farmers do for their crops. For them to understand what goes on with the farmers, as far as droughts, the, the things that we go through to fight, uh, to keep to not only feed ourselves and the families and other people. Not only is it important for farmers to learn more information, but for consumers too as well. I mean, I think it's important that we connect with consumers as much as we possibly can, and I think events like this help. Um, not only do we have farmers in, in, the, in the audience, but we also have consumers, people that aren't familiar with agriculture. They just want to come and learn more about what we do every day, and it's important that we make that connection between the community and agriculture. Now, one topic that was discussed was the farm bill, and expert discussed concerns some have over it. He talked about how it would be hard to pass because of a few key issues, including SNAP benefits. All right, Brianna, thank you. And this is the sixth year the conference has been held in the Quad Cities.